Oh, look at Kay's beautiful ferns and hosta. Aren't they beautiful? Let's see what else. There's the pool. Lilacs. Milkweed. St. John's wort. Butterfly bush. Big pile of weeds and Paul. Actually, that's not weeds. That's former honeysuckle bush. Yeah, we're better off without it. We don't want to look at the messy, messy patio. No, we don't. <laughs> oh, well. There's our new evergreens. They're going to grow and hide the pool pump equipment from the patio. There is our recovering hydrangea. And there are some pretty flowers and things. Some of these flowers were growing horizontally, and we had to rescue them with some hoops. Hopefully they will recover. There's some nice strawberry banana yarrow. These are the firebird echinacea, coneflowers, regular yarrow. Ooh, these are my favorite. These are the coral cream. Oh, look, one's bloomed. The coral cream drop phlox. Oh, I love that color. That's the first one of the year opened up fully. Looks like a star. And let's see. Hid coat lavender and English lavender. And something is munching on my columbine, my aquilagia black barlow. Uh, sunflowers, and hidden back there is a helianthus that might come back, and these delphinium, very pretty. I forgot what that burgundy thing is on the stake, but it blooms in the fall with white flowers. And as you can see, I badly, badly need to mulch. Oh, and there's pampas grass, always exuberant. And let's see. Oh, look, we must have soil that is acetic and basic because there's pink and there's blue On the same plant and that's it from the yard there are your lovely ferns oh that's a fig by the way <laughs> say goodbye to your lovely ferns hi Kay Bye, K.